in the name of Allah, the merciful, we're still in the domain A, and our next element is A.3, Infection Prevention and Control Committee. The total number of elements is six. An activity for auditing is document, staff interview, and the score will be zero, one, two. A 3.1 there is written approved term of reference document for the infection prevention and control committee containing structure rules duties and members responsibilities and is evaluated by documents review the following document term of reference of the IBC committee meeting and verify the following Number one, term of reference are valid and updated. Number two, approved by top administration. Number three, structure composition of the IBC committee with inclusion of membership from all relevant units. A 3.2 meeting minutes are written in manner of task force table within the limits for the action needed and action must be followed in the next meeting and is evaluated by documents. A 3.3 IBC committee is chaired by the hospital director or medical director and is evaluated by documents. A 3.4 membership of IBC committee include from all relevant unit example IBC department member, medical director, head of nursing service, and other guest member as needed and is evaluated by documents. Review the following documents, term of reference, meeting minutes, and attendance sheets. A 3.5 IBC committee meets on a regular basis at least quarterly or when they required on urgent demand and is evaluated by documents. A 3.6 function of IPC committee include but not limit to revision and evaluation of IPC early plan, review and approved of IPC policy and procedure, review of surveillance data, and discuss the respiratory protection program related activity and measures, and is evaluated by document and interview. Review the following documents. Number one. Review the minute meeting to check the content issue discussed in the past three meeting and check the status. In review number one, at random member of IBC committee representative during rounds to assess if they are aware and well informed with regard to IBC committee frequency of meeting. Number two, Ask how they are acting as the advocate of IBC in his her department, trying to promote this principle and ensuring the application of their rules. Example, encourage healthcare workers to comply with the IBC policies and the procedure in their representative unit. Number three, ask if the committee representative were aware about healthcare associated infection and the hand hygiene trend project in the last committee meeting concerned their unit and action taken to reduce them. Number four, ask if they face any new issues related to IBC in their unit's area, how they are addressing it. Thank you for listening.